What's up, YouTube? This Rose Go back with another video. Now, check it out. Malcolm X daughter calls for congressional investigation into father's 1965 murder. Yeah, she's taking it there. Malcolm X daughter, Miss Shabazz. Miss Shabazz. Request comes for after ABC News aired its new special on the civil rights activists. Soul of a Nation presents exonerated the murder of Malcolm X and 55 Years to Justice on Friday on Hulu. This is what she's saying. Miss Shabazz, Malcolm X's daughter, we want to know the truth. We want to know why our father was killed and who did it. Shabazz told ABC News. She also goes on to say, I knew about my father. I knew about my daddy. I knew about my mother's husband. But I had never learned about Malcolm X, the icon. And in college I did. Right? She had to learn about her father in college. Mm. In 2021... Nation of Islam members Muhammad Aziz and Khalil Islam were exonerated through evidence previously withheld by the FBI and the NYPD. Huh? Shabazz goes on to explain. There were so many who said that these men who were serving time were not the actual people who pulled the trigger. Shabazz explained. Shabazz was only three years old when Malcolm X, when Malcolm X was shot and killed February 21st, 1965. Malcolm was only 39 years old, people. Shabazz states he spoke truth to power and especially during a time when there was no one doing it, she added. Rest in peace, Malcolm X. Salute. Now, this story, I want to get this out. I want to pass it along to the people because Miss Shabazz ain't playing, all right? And she needs to know what happened to Malcolm X, her father. Now, Malcolm X was 39. Young Dolph is 36 when he died. And I'm not comparing them. I'm just going to make a point. Uh... Because no way, let me make this clear, no way, that's why I'm not trying to compare them. It's not a comparison. But one part of this is a comparison. But not as far as Young Dolph was like a Malcolm X, you know, that was none of that. They were total opposite people. Total opposite. I get it. I get it. But I'm, I'm going to make a point. So Malcolm was 39. He was young. That's my point. Young Dolph, 36. Young. That's my point, people. Shabazz was only three. Dolph's daughter is, I think they said she was four. Similarity, similarity. And his son can't be too far from that. All right? Finna make a point. All right? What, what else was said? Oh, the, they're, uh, now they're saying that these men, two of, two of these men, out of the three, these men were who were serving time were not the actual people who pulled the trigger people that reminds me it just reminds me of what's going on with the young Dolph case because i said in a couple videos ago that now i'm starting to believe that maybe these guys aren't the trigger men the trigger happy finger people they killed Dolph. Because when you look at the still pictures and stuff, their frames, yeah, look totally different. I don't know what's going on with that. Editing, yeah, maybe. Legend, maybe, yeah. Okay? They hiding something, right? And why would you have to hide something if you know these are the actual people that did it? You don't need to hide nothing, okay? You don't need to hide nothing. And then you probably got them in there to take it for somebody else because they might be getting off, God forbid. All right? Now, back to this, Dolph and Malcolm X. Uh, it's so similar and I made a video yesterday about Gotti 
and I was saying in there that, uh, see, people don't think. You see just how years later she wants to know what happened to her daddy who killed him for real, this and that, this and that. What if if we if if Dolph doesn't get his true justice, what do you think his children are gonna do when they get older? They're gonna wanna know who killed their daddy and why they did it. And they gonna want names, all right? See, see, that's my point, people. When I made that video yesterday, it was it was heart. It came from the heart. And let me tell you something. It came from the heart, first of all. And second of all, people don't be thinking about all the children you guys are making out here and you're living this crazy life like this and your children have to grow up and be mad at each other because of what has gone on before in the past be before you know and I asked y'all I said would they be wrong for, for, for going to see about who killed their daddy. Would they be wrong? In my eyes, no. But see, I'm not the law. Huh? But I would say no. It's just how I feel. See? See how that works? So, that's what I'm saying, people. The actions, the things we do, the choices we make in life, people. Now I'm back to Young Dolph. The choices we make in life, people, they affect everybody around you. All right? Not only yourself, but they affect everybody around you. The dog on me loves you. They care about you. Okay? And when you're leaving seeds on this earth, people, and you're leaving early, not from no, not from no natural causes or nothing like that. You know? It's some street stuff, so they stay. Oh, that's the street beef right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to get down to that too. Huh? Come Monday, right? Come Monday. So, yeah, that's what I'm saying, people. It was a little similarity in there as far as that what made me say this. Because, see, she grown-ass woman, right? She still want to know. All right? Now, however now however she wants to get closure, I, I don't know how that's going to make her feel when she really gets the answer she's looking for. You see? But I know one thing, it'll give her closure. That's that's number one thing she's trying to get is closure, people. Closure. Ain't that sad? Yeah. Still don't know. Yeah, she still don't know. One thing about it, she ain't giving up. She wanna know. Okay? Now however, now however she takes that and what she does with that. Would she be wrong? Not in my eyes. Huh? But I ain't the law. Allegedly. I I I I I you know what I'm saying? I ain't got nothing to do with that. You feel me? So she wouldn't be wrong, allegedly, in my eyes, put it like that. She she wouldn't be wrong. I, I and I I really doubt if she do something like that, but I'm just saying. You feel me? Yeah. So I thought I'd just leave y'all with that. It is Black History Month, even though I do not celebrate it, but I thought this was a very, very interesting uh article about your boy Malcolm X's daughter, Miss Shabazz. I cannot and forgive me, because I cannot say her name, her first name right. And it's L-L-Y-A-S-A-H. Shabazz. So I just call her Miss Shabazz. Uh, and I don't even want to say it wrong. You know what I'm saying? So I think it's Lisa or something. Lisa? Lisa? Something like that, y'all. Miss Shabazz. Anyway, long live Dolph, man. Message.